Hi, I'm Brad. Uh, and I'm John. We're Generation X Reacts, and what are we continuing on with today? Uh, this is a request. Okay. Um, it's a bit of an old request. And it's music. Yeah, it's music. From 1956. Oh. So, way yeah. back. Yeah, way in the way back. I should um, say that a little now before back. It's. Let's see. It has been covered a few times. Oh. Including by Marilyn Mansell in 19. Marilyn? <laughs> Ooh. Marilyn Manson in 1995. Um, So it was covered on his Smells Like Children album. But this is the original version by uh, Jealousy Screaming Jay Hawkins of I Put a Spell on You. Uh Oh. Um, Actually, so. The only one I know of is the uh, one from that movie. What is like Ben Mittler and stuff? Oh, he did that. yes. Yeah, that's another version of it too. And I don't think I've ever seen the movie. I've just seen that like song, s- song of it and different things. Yeah. Th- this was actually selected as um, one of uh, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame's 500 songs that um, shaped rock and roll. Yeah. Um, even though it was originally. Um, he, uh, he originally intended to record this as a refined love song a blues ballad oh. uh, although apparently the story goes that uh, before recording uh, ribs and chicken and beer arrived and this is kind of um, what came out afterwards okay so yeah, what one of the uh, godfathers, shall we say, of the uh, shock rock genre. And oddly enough, this is actually from the north, from Granada TV. So it's actually <laughs> recorded from a British TV station. Oh, there you go. Which is really amusing, because I'm pretty sure I found it on a Russian YouTube <laughs> channel. Whatever. I forget exactly. <laughs> it was one of the few live-ish performances that I could find of the song. So. Oh, so it's live. Yeah, it's, a, it's an actual live performance from back in the 50s. So it's black and white. Obviously, it's black and white. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we have. One, two, three! <laughs> that was extremely weird. Wings and beer. <laughs> or oh, in the wings. No, it's in the beer. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can see why he you know, he's kind of one of the godfathers of shock rock genre. Yeah. Well, yeah, especially from the 50s. Yeah. He uh, he originally wanted to be an opera singer too, oh. so he actually did, he really does have one hell of a good voice. Stop the things you do. Oh, my God. 
Also, he does very theatrical show as well. Uh, yeah, you can say that. It's, it's like I said, extremely surprising that this is from the fifties. Yeah. Like I said, you can really see what, and you, you can also see why one of the you know five hundred most influential songs. I mean, when you realize just how old it is. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of like. I would honestly say that Marilyn Manson performance of it would probably be boring in comparison. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard him sing. I think I have, but it was probably just I don't on the album. of his music, only a couple of the, like probably major hits. I don't care if you don't want me. I say I'm yours right now. Well, that was very unusual. Yeah, weird, but entertaining. I guess. <laughs> that yeah. yeah I'm, I'm just surprised it's from the fifties, honestly. Yeah. yeah. Nineteen fifty-six. Yeah. Hmm. Recording could have been a little bit later, but yeah, well, yeah. from nineteen fifty-six. Yeah. Well. I would never watch that on my own if it was <laughs> someone did um, request it. But hey. He is a very good singer, though. So, yes, yeah, so I'll got to start somewhere, I guess. Mm -hmm. And I made it to the top 500, you said. Of, yep. You know. On, so. on the uh, 500 songs that shaped rock and yeah. roll as we know it. I mean, you can, actually, you can really kind of see it, too. Yeah. And there's definitely aspects of it, you know. Mm hmm. So. Well, what was what was the name? I put a spell well, on you it. by uh, Jelancy Screaming Jay Hawkins. Oh, okay. Well, we'll maybe check more out from him. <laughs> we shall see. He actually probably has another few um, a few more songs that you actually probably would recognize as well. Well, well then we probably will check out yeah. more from him. So he, if you want to, uh, huh? He, he, you know, his his range goes from, you know blues, obviously, um, shock rock. That one, yeah. um, but you know rhythm and blues and soul and rock and roll is you know it's very wide repertoire of stuff. So, well, we'll definitely then have to check out more from him. So mm -hmm. if you want to see those, make sure to hit the like and the subscribe yeah, and the notification. And button. until next time, thanks for watching. <laughs>